how CR3 crash data is connected to other systems. While it may seem like the main uses of your CR3 crash reports are insurance companies and courts, the reality is that your data is connected to many systems maintained by Texas agencies. Without even knowing it, you may have contributed to and benefited from these systems. When you complete a CR3 crash form or make a traffic stop, you access data from three statewide systems through your agency software, driver's license, department of motor vehicles, and the roadway data system. These data systems provide you with the information to support your safety. The Texas Department of Public Safety Driver's License Division has custodial responsibility of the Texas Driver Data System, which contains nearly 23 million records. This database ensures you have up-to-date driver's license information when you have a traffic encounter. The driver's system maintains all critical information including driver's personal information, license type, endorsements, status, conviction history, crash involvement, and driver training. The state's driver data system interacts with the National Driver Registers Problem Driver Pointer System and the Commercial Driver's License Information System. The Texas Department of Motor Vehicles has custodial responsibility for the state's vehicle data system that maintains all vehicle title and registration records in the registration and title system. Critical information related to ownership and identification of the state's vehicles, such as vehicle make, model, year of manufacture, body type, and title brands is stored in RTS. TexDMV validates every vehicle identification number via the Vintelligence verification software. The state provides title information for original Texas titles and salvage and non-repairable titles to the National Motor Vehicle Title Information System. This system ensures you have accurate vehicle information during traffic encounters. The Texas Department of Transportation is the agency responsible for collecting and maintaining the roadway information for the state. Roadway and traffic data elements are maintained within a statewide linear referencing system. Through the system, TxDOT maintains data on over 300,000 miles of public road. When you provide geographic reference points, it enables linkages between road, traffic data, bridge, and pavement condition databases in the Geospatial Roadway Inventory Database. Local data is submitted to TxDOT then validated to be included in the system. Crash data flows into three primary registry types, EMS or trauma registries, CRIS, and local agency record management systems. The EMS and trauma registries are managed by the Department of State Health Services Office of Injury Prevention. The Texas EMS and trauma registries is an online reporting system that collects legislatively mandated data on all EMS runs, traumatic brain injuries, spinal cord injuries, submersions, and other traumatic injuries based upon a specified criterion. The purpose of registries is to monitor and analyze the EMS and trauma care systems. Data is used to perform epidemiological investigations to identify public health issues and support injury prevention projects, which ultimately improve the efficiency and quality of care that patients receive in Texas. This data is used by the Texas Traffic Records Coordinating Committee to investigate a variety of traffic safety related issues, including the examination of EMS response time and impacts of not getting individuals involved in crashes to trauma hospitals within the golden hour. This information informs infrastructure improvements and resource allocation to support all first responders. CRIS is the central repository for crash records. Crash data is used by many traffic safety stakeholders to conduct problem identification, project prioritization, and resource allocation. Problem identification is conducted for the Highway Safety Plan. The crash analysis and visualization tool is used to enhance the process of selecting safety projects to submit for HSIP funding consideration. Many law enforcement agencies are using data-driven strategies to make decisions on staffing and scheduling, which includes using crash data. CRIS data flows into the Fatality Analysis Reporting System, which is a nationwide census providing NHTSA, Congress, and the American public yearly data regarding fatal injuries suffered in motor vehicle traffic crashes. Crash data also flows into each law enforcement agency's own record management system that houses their agency data. Agencies use this data to inform decisions and identify areas that need increased enforcement. Information from law enforcement agencies' RMSs flow into court CMSs, Texas does not have a unified court system and lacks a statewide citation system. Instead, courts and law enforcement agencies are independent of one another regarding the management of citations. 
There are numerous court management systems and records management systems in use by courts and law enforcement agencies around the state. Consequently, there is no citation data uniformity across the state and records are created and stored by each individual agency instead of a central reporting system and repository. Chris and court CMS data flow into driver records. In some cases, a court may require an individual to seek drug or alcohol treatment. Documentation of court-ordered treatment fulfillment resides in the court CMS. As you can see, the information you provide has lasting effect because it is used to support safety, funding, and infrastructure decisions across the state and in your community. Thank you for your commitment to providing quality data.